Great. Somebody gave this customer someone else's prescription in drive through What? What's the prescription number? Let me look it up. That was Mark. Mm -mm. That's his third incorrect package sold this week. Whew. Mm. I don't know where y'all found him. Hey girl, can you ring me up for this tea? Did you hear what Mark did in the pharmacy? Mark, you know, the middle-aged husky white dude, he got the dad bod with no kids. Yeah, him. Oops, I didn't spill some tea. Speaking of spilling tea, y'all heard what Mark did? Mark handed a customer and drive through the wrong prescription. This is the third time he did that this month. Y'all know Mark used to work at the post office. Mm-hmm. He told me he don't know why he got fired. <laughs> Hell, I do. I can only imagine how many people got the wrong package on his route. Whew. I bet you that was a mess. Guess who opened up the pharmacy late? I went to go check. We ain't got that drug in stock. But guess who is stepping down? The pharmacy manager at MacArthur? Mm-hmm. He said he can't take this shit no more. He's getting him a job over there at Memorial at the hospital. I said, well, when you get settled in, take me with you, okay? <laughs> Tell nobody, so don't say nothing, okay? Y'all mind if I join y'all little smoke break out here? <laughs> Oh no, I don't smoke cigarettes. I just tell my girl on smoke break so I can come out here and spill some tea. Y'all, guess who is stepping down from being pharmacy manager? Ma'am, I'm sorry about your weight. We got a bunch of new hires and they don't know what they doing. We so desperate, we just hire anybody off the street. I swear in the interviews, they don't be checking references or resumes. Hell, the only thing they be checking for is a pulse and some availability, okay? Hi, this is Carol calling from another store. Can I speak to Pam about a mutual patient? Hey Pam, this is Carol. Yeah. Now what happened? I heard Kiki got a final written warning. What the hell does she do now? That girl stay in trouble. Hold on. Ma'am, I'll be right with you. I'm doing something for another patient. Okay, Kiki did what? Girl. Yeah, I grabbed the counter. I'm helping a customer real quick. Yeah, Mrs. Johnson. Now you said your son went to jail for what? Ooh. Mm-mm-mm. That boy needs Jesus. Ma'am, I apologize about the pharmacist's attitude, but she's going through a divorce right now. Mm-hmm. Her husband left her for the girl that used to work up front. Mm-hmm. Store manager came back here and asked me why my area was so messy. <laughs> I said, why are your employees so messy? <laughs> okay. You worried about my mess. You need to worry about the messiness going on in this store. You know the new assistant manager, Amanda? Yeah, I added her on Facebook. I noticed when I was going through her pictures, Mark liked all her sexy photos. Ain't Mark married? Oops, let me stop, let me stop. We just hired Crystal? Yeah, I added her on Facebook. I was looking at her photos. She used to be skinny. Some pharmacist put the wrong insulin in this patient's bag. You know what, I knew she was gonna make a mistake. As often she was checking that phone. She was checking her phone every five minutes. Maybe if she checked them prescriptions, like she checked that phone, she probably wouldn't make that mistake. Hey, John, this customer is cussing the pharmacy manager out. <laughs> last Thursday, the Florida pharmacist gave her the wrong insulin. You remember the pharmacist last Thursday? The real cute one with the big wedding ring that you kept flirting with? Mm-hmm. Yeah, the married one. Yeah, yep. Yeah. <clears throat> yep, she put the wrong insulin in the bag. I think about the same time you was flirting with her. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Luckily, the patient caught it or or patient could have died. Lucky for you because... Since you were flirting with her when she made the mistake, they might have charged you with second degree murder, involuntary manslaughter, or something. One of them. Who called off last night? Jason? He was sick? I don't know about that. Cause I was on his Facebook page. He was at a country concert. Oop, let me stop. Let me stop. Great. This is Lucinopril 20. It's supposed to be Lucinopril 10. 
Who filled the cell wrong? You mean somebody put Lisinopril 20 in the Lisinopril 10 spot in the Uyama machine? Ooh, I gotta figure out who did this. Let me check, who closed last night? It was either Mark or Sarah. Let me, I'm at the checklist now. Let's see, fill in the cell. It was Sarah, Sarah did it. I'm the only person in this pharmacy that filled the cell correctly, okay? I'm the only one that scanned the bottle. The rest of them just be opening it up and dumping it and resetting the Uyama. I'm the only one to do things by the rules. Psst, psst. Hurry up, girl. I don't want these people to see me spilling tea. Did you hear what Sarah did? Girl, she dumped a whole bottle of Lisinopril 20 in the Lisinopril 10. Shoot, these people don't read. They just be dumping pills in the random cells. I mean, hell, if you wanted to dump stuff someplace and not read, you should have worked for the sanitation department. You can't find Mrs. Johnson's prescription? Oh, let me see what time it was verified. Mm-hmm. It was verified at 2.45 yesterday. I'm going to go check the cameras. Hey, store manager, can you review the cameras? I need to see who's putting the prescriptions in the wrong bins. I bet it's Mark. I know it's Mark because he's kind of slow. It was Amber? What? Hey y'all, I had the store manager look at the cameras. It was Amber. I knew it. I was telling him when I was back there. Watch this be Amber. I swear lunch be going by too fast. Let me put my coat in my locker. Ooh. They got the manager's office door closed. Who's that back there? That Becky? Ooh, the manager and the assistant manager talking to Becky. Ooh, she getting written up. Oh, let me see if I can listen. Let me pretend to put my coat back. <laughs> Girl, I was putting my coat in my locker. I saw Becky in the office get written up. Mm-hmm. They had the door shut. I could see the store manager. He was yelling. Becky crying like her dog died. Mm. I wonder what she did. Psst, psst. You know why Becky getting written up? Oh, you ain't no good to me. Go back to work. Rashonda, I walked past the office and I saw Becky getting written up. What happened? What? I'm about to go take me a 15. Girl, I got to hear this. Girl, girl, let me get out the forward apartment. I just came over here to tell you what Mark did. I didn't spill so much tea today. I really need to walk around with a bucket and a mop, okay? Clean up on aisle messy. What Cardi B say? That wop, I got that wag. <laughs> Wet ass gossip. Ooh. Let me hurry up and get back to the pharmacy for my pharmacy manager to get here in five minutes. <laughs> I don't want him thinking all I do is gossip, okay? Girl, don't worry about them honking. Them people Kuwait. Now what happened? So your sister's baby daddy did what? <gasps> What's up, mama? Let me tell you about these people at my job. <laughs> Girl, they so trifling. They stay in other people's business. Be gossiping all day, girl. Whew.